What's up guys? I've set up a haunted escape room for Bradley to go through and each level that he beats he gets $10. But if he fails, all his money is gone. There's 10 levels so he could end up getting up to $100 by the end of this. So you might want to stick to the end to see what he wins. But here's the twist. He can either decide to cash out at any time that he wants or he can just keep going until he loses his money or makes it to the end. And I know that you guys kind of want him to make it to the end, but I don't feel like giving away $100. So stick to the end to find out what happens. I'm gonna give you a little tour of this haunted room. And right here um, is a pumpkin, which Bradley over here, his starting messages will be in. Um, you'll kind of know what I mean as we go on. Uh, here's, there's just some spooky scenes. You can't see that very well because it's dark in here because it's very spooky. Um, here is a safe. I'll get to that later. Here, just some decorations. And this, um, well, this is a broken lamp that flickers. There, it's supposed to. You'll see it flick. Okay, yeah. Um, normally whenever you move it flickers. Yeah, like that. So, anyway, Bradley has to find a way to open that safe. So, there will be notes and clues around to help him get the code to that safe. And, let me open the safe really quick. This will not be the first code. I still have to set it. Inside this safe is a pumpkin. Just like this one. Yeah, but that one doesn't count. And right here is a bowl. Pumpkins. He has to place that pumpkin in the bowl before his time is up. Um, each time gets shorter every round. Um, you're probably tired of seeing rules, so let's get on with number one. Do it in here. Okay, so just a few more things to explain to you. The lowest number of um, numbers on the code will be four. And you have one hint every two rounds make sense okay okay get out there and i'm gonna set up the first one and bradley has entered the room and your time will start now <clears throat> k plus c subs you have 10 minutes and it's probably the easiest thing ever okay Actually, Let's see. aha! What was that? <laughs> this is not scripted. You do not have to act surprised. Aha! Thirty-four. Hmm. There. Thirty four, forty six. <clears throat> Better. What? What? Okay. Hint, which one came first? <gasps> hey! Okay, so Bradley, you have completed your time. Here's $10. Would you like to keep that $10, or would you want to risk that for the next level for $20? 20 bucks! All right, number two. Your time starts in three, two, one, go. Um, why aren't you moving? Why aren't you moving? Aren't oh, you moving? Sorry. I was just shopping on eerypoxyworks.com. Oh, yeah. Eerypoxyworks is a really good website. 
The front page has contact info. Select the three lines. Then you can either shop, custom products, outdoor bar, cabinetry, or exterior remodeling. But we're going to go to shop. So here's just a list of products. I'm going to click on one to show you an example. Um, you can get them custom made or you can just buy one of them. Um, pick how many you want. You can even pick a color. Um, and then just scroll down, add to cart, and it has some product info there. And um, yeah, that's it. But anyways, go! A plus. You're not allowed to copy off math tests. It's a good, a good, a good answer. A good, a good answer. Hmm. There's nothing on there. Those are for later. Um. Two, one, or not. A good, a good answer. Hmm. A good, a good answer. What's that mean? A good, a good answer. It means I'm trying to waste your time. You already read something important. Two. One. Bradley, I'm sorry to break it to you, but you're never going to get it if you don't copy off a math test. Ah. How do you not know where the math test is? Editor, play this back. A plus. You're not allowed to copy off math tests. Uh... There's nothing though. What? It throws the paper. Pumpkin. Oh. All right. And now I'm going to get back to shopping at Eerie Poxy Works. Here's your $20. You can use that to shop on eerypoxyworks.com right mm. now. Or you can go to the next challenge and try to get $30. And by the end of this, you could end up with $100. $30. $30. Okay. All right, Bradley. And your time starts now. And place in hot skillet, um, cooked until golden, flip finger, side melon slices, sausage and bean soup. What? <laughs> Look! That's what it says in here! Okay, there is no note in that pumpkin. <laughs> okay. Where is this? S? The aced is. There's not even an A in that word. Oh. No. What? What is it? The code is under the bowl. Thanks. You just probably slowed yourself down. But it doesn't matter. Bull must be on the drum.
All right, Bradley, here I have $30, or you can go for the $40. 40. Not even hesitant at all. Okay, guys, after this level, I know that we were all wondering what he was reading, and I was wondering too. And there's actually a note that says that in there. But uh, anyway, uh, yeah. And the escape room for $40. Your time starts now. What? Uh, P.S. Um, uh, I don't know what that says. P.S. Just this sheet. Hmm. What does PSM, whatever, PSNS mean? The S's really don't mean anything. Pumph. They're just plural. They're making the letters oh, plural. P's, M's, P's, N's. Mm. Okay, one. there is one word on that paper that you literally took no note of. Oh, wait, I got it. Two, one, two, one. Big brain. Big brain, big brain. Oh. Yeah, are you ready to get like, 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 please me? Big brain, big brain, makes up look what a normal- You could walk away with this $40, $40 right now, or you can risk it all. If you go for the 100 and you lose all your money, I won't feel bad for you. Bye. All right, are you ready? This level's probably one of the easiest levels. There's one way easier, but under market set, go if you didn't already grab that paper. Wait, what? Wait, what? Um... That's P all. times All right, Bradley, in my hands is $50. You can walk away with this or go for 60 in the next level. $60. Okay, and it is time for the next level. This one is rather easy. Three, two, one, go. Where's the queen? The red thing. It's checkers! Okay, well, it's a queen. Because there was no queen. Now, for the more questions. Three. Oh, wait. Three. Five. Zero. One. Too smart. All right, Bradley, in my hand is 60 bucks. Would you like to advance to the next level and risk all this money, or would you like to cash out? Risk it all. You're stupid. Okay, Bradley, this is a hard level. It's one of those levels where you either get it or you don't get it, so you might need to use a hint on well, this What one. else would happen? I mean, like, it'll either click right away or... It won't. Three, two, one, go. All right. Two. 
two. Why are there two twos? Huh. You can use a hint. You have like two minutes left. Uh, I'll use a hint. Fine. Um. Would you give okay. me a hand? I don't know like how to do it without giving this away. Okay, so guys, here's the paper. So. I'll start you off. Give me a marker. Hold the camera on this. I'll just basically do one part for you. Which two? Second letter of which is I. Third letter in skeleton, E. First letter of zombie, Z. Second letter of bat, A. Go. You can look stuff up. Aiza! Now turn those into numbers. Big hint. <laughs> really, really big hint. You have less than a minute. <laughs> turn those into numbers. Ow! You could lose $60 here. Uh, uh, what number in the alphabet are those? Um, How much time left? Less than 30 seconds. 20. 19. Okay. Uh, 18. 17. 16. 15. 14. 13. 12. 11. Like so bad. 10. Hurry, hurry, dude, hurry, hurry, hurry. And that timing might have been close. Might have been. But I'm going to give it to you. Bradley, this is $70. This is going to be the most money I've ever given up on my channel. Now, you can go all the way until 100. You can go for 80, go for 90, or cash out for 70. Or you could end up with nothing. What's your decision? Make you broke. Okay, and he's gonna continue. Bradley, for eighty dollars. Um, this one you're probably gonna need to use your resources on because I doubt that you have this memorized. Three, two, one, go. You have three minutes. Uh, you can't really see it because the writing's in orange. Okay, you can see it. I was expecting Wait, what? that you couldn't see it as much on camera. Oh, it's the order. Hmm. Yeah, it's gotta be the order of those books. Does it? Does it, though? How much time do I get? Um, you have about two minutes left. Okay. A little more.
one, three, two, six. Hurry up! Is it green? I don't know, watch it closely. Go. Ten dollars? No. All right, here I have four 20s, which is $80. You can risk this for $90 for a chance of nothing, or you can keep the $80. Make Andrew broke. Okay, Bradley, yeah. you have two minutes to do this, probably the easiest one yet, and you guys should help him do this. Go, go, go. No. Hmm? Uh... All right, guys, for eighty dollars, you have to subscribe to my channel as well. No. Well, why not? <laughs> it's your money. <laughs> Yay! Wait. He's probably gonna unsubscribe after. And you gotta make sure notifications. Oh, okay. Yep, and that's how you do it, people. Treat Bradley the same way. Thanks for doing that. Thank you. <laughs> I think that was the Please plan. do it. Please. All right. Thank you. Okay, so I'm not even going to show you the money, but do you want $90? Or do you want to go for the 100 Make Gandra Roke. Make Gandra Roke. Okay. Make Gandra Roke. He has a minute to solve this one. Here is what he has. A paper with some holes in it. It says top. Yes, it says top on it. Um, there's nothing in there. Nothing under there. What? What's it supposed to be? Uh -huh. Oh, come on. What's it mean, top? You can use a hint, you know. Hint. That on. note, put it on that note. Oh. What? Under the sink. Time is up, Bradley. The note was under the safe. Screw <laughs> The time is up. He lost. His hundred dollars.